Also, I figured new edition kind of funny. My mother was taking some stuff over to the thrift store. They've been finally clearing out our storage and they're finding a lot of my Pokemon stuff that I've been showing. And it's kind of funny. She saw, she really likes getting the bobbleheads. So she saw this one. It's a Pete Alonzo bobblehead. And I'm pretty sure it's from the Saint, when he, I guess he was on the St. Lucie Mets at some point or something like that. I think. I'm assuming that's because I'm not sure why. It was the New York Mets. I guess spring training. They don't do. I feel like they wouldn't have done it for spring training. Uh, I feel like it'd be like a minor league kind of thing because they do that a lot. But Pete Alonso bobblehead from 2020. But she, she got it at like a couple dollars. I thought that was pretty funny. I'm not a Mets fan, but Pete Alonso is pretty cool. And I thought that was cool. I forget how much she said. I think it's like five or seven dollars or something like that. Which is pretty good. That's like the price of a ticket. And we didn't have to go drive 45 minutes to game. So... That's cool. I thought that was fun. We got ourselves an envelope. We got this back in July. Well, at least it was sent out in July, so it was probably around that time. I've been saving this since. We have got a couple back. Uh, that's what I, I've been holding. That We haven't been getting that very many envelopes back. So, yeah. We've uh, we've been holding on this one for a while. That Like I always say, I try to keep one envelope. I try to open up an envelope as I get one back kind of thing, so I always have at least one for when I would want to make a video kind of thing. But yeah, it's, it's uh, not many coming back, especially during the, it's already been the end of the season for like, what, a month now. So I don't know, maybe once, a couple months from now, but let's see, this feels one card and well, that's hockey. I see an NHL hockey. Let me send out hockey. Cool. West Walls. That came out pretty good despite it being like the black jersey kind of thing. That's pretty cool for the Bruins. Thank you, Mr. Walls. I'm assuming, yeah, Upper Deck 1992. I don't remember sending this out. This must have been a random card find. But yeah, that turned out pretty good. That's cool. That's a very hard, I mean, if you'd, you had to have like a silver or gold Sharpie to even make that show up, but you can still see it. It's pretty cool. Thank you, Mr. Walls. Let's see when we sent that out. Hopefully we tracked it, because I don't know if I, I don't remember typing in. All right, I figured we'd throw in an extra. Got this one back on September 15th from Tampa St. Petersburg. So, this should be a four by six. I don't think I feel a card in there. This is before, I'm guessing, uh, that I sent, I got those, I forget what size envelopes, but they fit the four by six pictures perfectly. So, hopefully this is like one of the last ones we sent out like that. Not sure on what, oh. Oh, I think I, I could see the hat. I think I know. There's only one picture. Uh, well, let's see. Ooh. Yeah, her. I can't remember her name. Is it Rachel? No. I feel like that's different. Oh my gosh. Completely blanking out on her name. But thank you. <laughs> uh, I can never read cursive anyway. But I think she's like one of the first female... Is it like manager? I think she's in charge of the minor league team over there for the Yankees. I think that that's Tampa Tarpons, right? I believe. Oh my gosh, completely blanking out on her name. Uh, but thank you, this came out really nice. Well, this is, well, it's just September. We'll look it up. This was out for a little while, because I'm pretty sure I sent this to spring training. So, yeah. And then we got it back September. That came out really nice. That's awesome. I don't know if she has a card or not. I bet you she has one in Allen & Ginter or something like that. That'd be kind of cool. We'll try it next spring training, so. Yeah, that's awesome. Thanks a lot. I can't believe I'm blanking out on her name. All right, cool. So it looks like we sent out to unfocused. Well, there we go. Wes Walls on October 26, 2021. It's kind of funny. It was almost a year. <laughs> that, I forget the date on the envelope when we got it back. So a little bit less than a year. Pretty close to a year. I think that's a house address in Minnesota. But yeah, that's pretty cool. Thank you, Mr. Walls. That came out cool ourselves hockey card i'm guessing this is just a card that i found whenever <laughs> a year ago last october it has like a kid or something like that randomly i just sent it out i found actually a bunch of i actually found a bunch i'll show those yeah that came out pretty cool and then i was right first i don't know why her, her first name is rachel rachel balkovic hopefully i said that somewhat correctly but i don't know why i thought the this kind of threw me off, but that's like E-L, I guess. It kind of looks the same. I was like, wait a minute. But yeah, I was right. It was Rachel. We sent this out on March 17th, 2022. 
to Steinbrenner Field, which is New York Yankee Spring Training. Another 232 days if we're putting that. We got it back today, November 4th. And it shows I put two pictures. I sent two pictures and we got one, but the like five other people that have sent to her only included or only sent one item. So I guess she only signs one thing. It is cool, you know. I don't. I don't. I just wish I remember what the. I don't even remember what the other picture was. Hopefully, this is like the better of the two pictures. So that's pretty cool. That'd be cool if. Uh, and it's kind of like a history thing, I guess. It would be that. She's, she is a manager, and I believe she's like the first female manager kind of thing. So I'm pretty sure she's in charge of the. Or she manages the, Tarpons, Tampa Tarpons, the New York. Yankees minor league, so that's pretty cool. Could probably they come over here. They should come over here. I don't know when, whenever minor league's going on, we could probably meet her over at a game about Roger Dean because they play the Hammerheads and the Palm Beach Cardinals. So that'd be pretty cool. If she has a card by then. But thank you to them both for taking the time to sign. That's pretty cool. Got ourselves a card and a four by six back. Yeah, hopefully we start getting more stuff in because we've sent a lot of stuff out. Just not lately. It just there's a lot of stuff floating around out there that hopefully comes back, you know? It's all dependent on whether people send it back. Yeah, onto the, the cards I was saying I've been finding. I've just been finding stuff like this, like mixed in kind of like the Pokemon cards. I haven't gone through them, there's like a bag of... Apparently, I have more of those game day cards. That's, uh, who is that? Chuck Person? And I see Carl Malone underneath that, but then I see a bunch of these game day cards. Which I love those. That's a whole bunch, like, that's probably like... 30 of them maybe? 20? Something? So that's pretty cool. So now, and I actually found another bag of them. So that's pretty sweet. Got a whole bunch of these now. So we'll try and send those out because I think some of those guys are still signing. And like a bag of, I mean, apparently Wayne Gretzky is on there. It's pretty cool. I don't know what your score that is, but I'm guessing that's hockey. Oh, let's open it. Oh, that just slid all over. I had a nine pocket page of some old baseball cards also. That slid across the room. I don't think I've looked through this. It's a pretty beat up. Daring Dogs. Pro set? What is it? That's some Wayne Gretzky stuff. Smackdown? What the rock, rock bottoming mankind? Poor guy. That's pretty cool. These guys are like super thick. Huh. Mark Messier. I don't really like him, kind of, just because he's Lipkowski, Sid Fernandez. So we got some baseball. D'Lo Brown. <laughs> right? That's his name. Yeah. <laughs> that guy was hilarious. That's, uh, I was into wrestling back then. What is this? John Jaha? Or super beat up, but it's like... Changes. Oh, does that not come across? Oh, it kind of does. In the camera? Those are funny. Helvin Harper? More Wayne Gretzky? I did like him a lot when I was a kid. Steve Shields, but yeah, it's just like a bunch of stuff. What is this? Jeff Gordon. Stock car? What the heck? Ivan Hernandez? I actually have a baseball from him. Bought Jeff Conine, Malins, Home Improvement, Hanging with the Boys. These guys are like a little stuck. It was a SmackDown. Can Garel? That guy always terrified me as a kid. How'd they make him? Like, just scaring kids. But yeah, I just, uh, I've been finding like a bunch of sports cards like that. Maybe we should try and see if we can get them. Are these signed kind of thing? I don't know. Maybe it'd be kind of fun. They're like all pretty beat up, but it would just be fun that it's like cards I had as a kid kind of thing. But yeah, we'll see. I mostly like focusing on like active mostly like baseball I, mean, I, sh I still haven't done football stuff yet and i was saying 
I should send some of that out, but we'll figure it out. Dolphins apparently playing well now that two is back. It's kind of cool. Hopefully it stays going like that and no more guys get injured on any team, but especially Dolphins because apparently it's happening a lot. But yeah, as always, thanks for watching. Hopefully you enjoyed.